Hello Trophy Hunters and welcome to today's game that we are covering the Horror Tales The Vine and uh, as you can know I already did upload video on my channel with all collectibles in this game but this time I will walk you uh, with 100% in this game so complete walkthrough with every collectible, every miscellaneous trophy ending and how to avoid or uh, go through the game so uh, full commented uh, if you want to have platinum really quick and uh, easy as fast as you can i do recommend following me uh, so let's just start with the settings i will explain why settings are really important i did tune down the audio so uh, you will mostly hear my voice instead of the games uh, just to be clear and so you can easily follow and you are doomed <laughs> to to my voice and uh, we want to go to accessibility tab and here uh, you want to go to i will go to gamma first uh, just for the purpose of this video i will go much much brighter so you can easily see on the screen what is happening because there is sometimes going to be very dark in this game also you want to go down below it is very important photo mode unlocked it says no you must uh, put it to yes and uh, why is that? that very simple you can pick up collectibles only sometimes with photo mode uh, unlocked so be sure to have photo mode unlocked and now after that you can just go back to main menu and just before we start you can press uh, and uh, the control for uh, photo mode is by your touchpad and going up and down will zoom onto collectibles let's just start press play select a new game and as you can see you can avoid these uh, stories or cutscenes with circle button this game is going to be very beautiful especially if you are playing on ps5 uh, it is really really nice very good looking and uh, I really admire it I really like it a lot we are just going to start here I will uh, try not to run as much as I could in this game because you, you can actually speed run it uh, you can run a lot faster as you can see with L1 button with L2 button you crouch you can crouch with L2 button but now we are going up here to the right and then to the left we can just a little bit run uh, when you run you can just uh, uh, press multiple times l1 uh, i will explain shortly why so here you want to enter through this door you will see a man with a gun so you want to go up here and fall down here pick up the key so you press circle button and pick up the, the key the, with the circle button press circle button again and now we have the key so go all the way here and crouch down with l2 button to go outside circle button again to open the door and circle button is your main button for making any action in this game uh, just to be clear for the running section when you start running you can easily run out of your gas <laughs> and uh, you will need to stop so just to know when you sometimes put L l1 button much more times uh, just click on it uh, it delays a bit so it helps a lot also you can move every uh, object in this game that is movable with circle button again and we are moving these bars here just going forward this is the area that we are going to come down uh, come down here later so now proceed to our main area which is here shortly just to explain but uh, i will just show you the answer in the future when you pick up this uh, these ones they are really important for uh, having the right answer uh, to go through the door so here is the first one and the second one is going to be right here but uh, i'm just showing you how i did get the answers if you just want to know that here is the second and uh, throughout the game you will see much much more and then when you you will, you will sometimes have a locked mechanism when you need to input these codes and this is how you find them just for the information but i will also put up the photos and you will be easy easy to follow here you can you must jump up 
and we are going to pick up our first collectible when you drop it down. So press circle button to pe pick up the first collectible and we get Eric Cat is my best friend and I agree. Jump on this rock here, jump down and go uh, crouch and go through this hole here. Now continue going down this path to the left and now to the right. You cannot unlock the door anymore. We have another one here. Now go back. And you want to go down through this hole here. Move out these boxes with circle button and go through this hole with L2 crouched. Okay. Move out these boxes here. If it doesn't let you, sometimes you need to do other things in order. And you want to fall down here. We have something that you can read, but it is really not necessary. You can now hold the circle button to interact with this lever. Continue going forward. Now you want to hold L1 and jump across the bridge here. And look to the left here. Here is our second collectible. So once you are here, press touchpad and go forward with it and exit with the touchpad and you will see the doors are removed. So you can now access the second collectible pick it up and after that you want to go here and fall down on these boxes here go all the way here and remove these planks and we want to use this one to go up just put it before the entry and go up now go to the wine cellar drop down here this is the mechanism that we will need later continue going through and he is our first jump scare so just run from him as fast as you can he will eventually catch you but nothing happens as you can see you are all clear but he will later be a much danger, much more danger to us. You can just continue going forward without any problems here. And we are in our first area here where you want to drop down. Walk on these planks. If something is really bothering you, you can just use circle button to remove it. We want to jump across here. You can just remove things with circle button as you can see yeah, because we want to go across all the way there enter here here we have the blue ones, blue ones these are the answers for our next mechanism and as you can see Things have changed a bit. Here is another one. And once we are here, I will just input the right answer. So here we want to have bottle. Here is the grapes. Bottle opener. And here is something like, I don't know, some kind of fruit and hold circle button and the doors will open 
So this is the right answer here. Go up and we get our first trophy for clearing the first area. Just continue running. And we are now in our second area, which is going to be a little bit tricky sometimes, but nothing still too special. So you want to go on this big plank here. It will eventually drop. Pick up this big brick here and put it on the plank and go all the way back. Here is the second big brick. Put it here. And now you can go up and we are going to jump all, all over there. So just run and jump here. Okay. So before we move on here, I will just try to explain. These uh, planks here, they are going to fall. So what you want ideally is jump here. As you can see, they are already falling. Jump here, crouch here, continue going and you are done. In this next section, our friend <laughs> that is chasing us is going to appear again and we need to outrun him, uh, go in the circles and pull the lever. Once we pull the lever, he will be gone and that will be uh, good for us, we will avoid him. So I recommend if you are not sure, just watch me first and you can repeat later. As you can see, just run 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 wait for him from the right side and now outrun him all the way to the end of this hallway here is a lever and hold a circle button to interact with the lever as you can see we are now we did hurt ourselves but we, when we move back again it should be open now and he is gone as you can see, we are free to roam. Continue going forward. He will not appear now in this section. All the way up. And you want to drop here first and then you want to drop here first but let me just tell you something what that we are going to do we are going to open this door and there is some cart this cart can go through this rail railway and we need to go all the way to that side and to this mechanism here you can go here as you can see from behind of this house what we need to do we need to start this uh, cart to move go all the way that back and jump on the cart and after that jump on this uh, bridge here I, if i am maybe too fast you can just watch me but i hope i did explain it because we are having a little bit time sequence here so just remove the plank as you can see here is the lever as soon as you interact it run behind the house wait for the cart and jump on the cart and now you want to jump here and we are true so don't worry if you really do, do miss it as you can see you can always interact back with the lever and you can send it back to the beginning go up interact with this lever and we are going to enter the maze and we want to go to the right to the left to the left to the right and we get to this tree remember that if you get lost so we are going forward to the right 
oh sorry 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 left and then right and then left left again now we want to go here to the left we want to go here not here continue going forward to the right and now as you can see here is the door you cannot open it but we need to go through this door here we are also going to pick up our third collectible and uh, one miscellaneous trophy so enter through this door here press touchpad to enter photo mode enter through this door here and now you can pick up third collectible enter through this door here look to the left and there is a wine bottle you need to jump on this balcony here all the way to there interact with circle button with this bottle and uh, rotate it rotate it you, when you when you hear the guy say something you will unload the trophy for finding special wine bottle put down the bottle and go back to the first balcony and now interact with this lever here go all the way across where we will find our second mechanism in the game and i will just input the code so it should be grapes first here then bottle then wine opener bottle opener then some kind of fruit and grapes again if that is correct the doors should open and they are opening for us <coughs> open another lever continue going forward just keep continue running and we have completed chapter number two skip this with circle button here we are in a <coughs> secret room uh, as you can see here is a key already you can see a key but you cannot go through this door what you want to do is crouch and just go through this here go forward remove this barrel crouch and go into this hole fall down crouch and continue going forward until you reach the end where you can stand up you can just also follow the candles sorry to the right <laughs> interact with this lever here continue going forward now once you can stand up jump here jump here jump here Oop. jump all over here and you can now jump here and you are in the area where the key is very easy and simple pick up the key remove the planks and open the door enter with this lever here now we can go all the way down and open the doors here with the key that we picked up in this room as you can see there are a lot of signs here these signs are indicating the solution for our final uh, locking mechanism but i will show you just the answer we want to go through this door here all the way to down <laughs> all the way down continue going forward cannot go yet okay go up enter hold the mechanism 
enter here and here as you can see here are some answers but I will just show you the right ones so bottle some kind of fruit and grapes oh sorry I grapes and the mechanism should work now amazing continue going forward as you will see him sometimes hold the circle button but we will need to prepare i think very soon about what is going to happen he is at the end of this hallway as you can see this first passage here first passage we first need to go to him for him to chase us after he starts chasing us you want to go back and go this first passage and then left you can just in this moment pause the game watch me and then do it yourself run hold the circle button and enter here and you will be safe you will be safe nothing can hurt you and we are done with this section first you want to fall down here and pick up our next collectible which is going to be under this bridge here crouch and pick it up you want to go back up You want to jump here now you want to jump on this here this plank or something wood now slowly make your way up to the left to the right forward jump here we need to crouch now to the left and when you hold l1 you can just drop down on this ledge here and we are true okay so you remove the plank here and we will enter the right code for this one it is going to be something like this i don't know what this really is sorry but i know what it needs to be okay this was a good one we ne didn't need to change one this is like some sort of something <laughs> and again the first sign and it should open the door when we hold this lever here and it opens very nice very quick don't go forward drop down continue going down look up here you want to run and jump up nice drop down here go all the way here and pick up the lever turn back we need to put lever inside this mechanism hold the button wait for it to open slowly go around it and now again interact with the lever and you will see that we are in a, now in the next area and now for this next area this is going to be a uh, um, cheerful uh, I will just start to explain and uh, I do recommend maybe just to follow me because uh, uh, let me just explain here is the lever as you can see when you pick up the lever our friend that is chasing us constantly will be back but you are slow uh, you are moving very slow with the lever and he can really easy kill you first 
you want to go all the way that here as you can see that big plank there there is the place where you can mechanism where you, where you can input lever inside and uh, when you push the lever the plank will, will drop down to a small small island on that small island there is a drawer where you can pick up the key and after that with that key you can you can open that door and go to our next sequence and practically end of the level but all that time he is chasing you and he can kill you so what you want to do pick up the lever uh, walk it uh, as far as you can then drop it go back all the way to this first section or behind this to gain some time then start running pick up a lever and with small steps uh, go to the first mechanism let me just show you He is here already, so you want to run. We did drop the, the lever. You want to go back to the first area. Wait for him. And now outrun him. Pick the lever. And again, continue going forward a little bit. You should listen to your sound. I cannot do that now because I did turn it off in order to make a guide for you. I will just drop it now good timing and you want to go all the way back to the first area again to gain some time before before he catches to you as you can see it will take him a long time now outrun him again but be sure to not run out of gas when you're running pick up the lever again we should be able to put it in this mechanism he is not here yet we could have okay we did press the lever and we need to run <laughs> this was a little bit risky but doable still so while we are waiting for him to appear again come come now go all the way back to that island across and here is the drawer pick up the key wait for him i think when you go all the way back he will just respawn so be careful i am not sure yet uh, i did forget a little bit okay yeah i was right so go all the way all the way back to the first area run up to the door open the door enter inside circle around it and he is closed perfect we did pass this section behind this should appear the door but we want to go all the way here to the end to see that there is nothing and when we go back there should be a door behind okay so we must be careful here not to miss our as you can see we get the trophy for a third chapter i think but we must be careful here to not miss the collectible which is all the way to the right continue going forward to these rocks press touchpad go under the rocks as you can see you can now access the collectible and we are done with this section i think okay uh, here, here is the man okay let me just remember what we need to do okay drop down drop down we will need to do a little bit of puzzle so go up this plank big plank here and it will drop down jump here and let me explain uh, you need to 
put the mechanism on this card to go forward. As you can see, here is some wood that will block this plank to go up when it is down. When you start the mechanism here, you want to go all the way behind and up to that plank there. You can just watch me. So enter the mechanism and just be fast, go up, jump on the plank to go down and you will be good. Okay, so it, it cannot go any more down. You want to run and you want to go here. Don't drop down. Do not do drop down. Go to the left. Here. Up, up, up. Drop down now. And we can now just go here. As you can see. And here is the lever. And you can enter this place here. Uh, first, in this area, I do want to apologize a bit because uh, it is uh, really always hard for me to remember uh, in this area. I, I, I really don't like this area, but I will try my best to show you really clear and fast what to do. So first, we want to go up. You cannot open this door, as you can see. We want to go left and up. We cannot go yet. Let me just take a moment. We will need a key for this one. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. We need to go down. And through this door. I still remember a bit. Down in this basement, there should be a flashlight. You can just move the boxes with circle button. Pick up the flashlight and press R1 to turn it on. But be aware, the flashlight has its time and it can just go off. So just be careful. Turn it off when you see that it starts flickering in order to uh, have better view. We want to go up. Now we can enter this area here, because we now can see with the lantern. As you can see, it is already overheated. We want to go here. We want to pick up this box. Okay, we want to, sorry. We want to put the box on this ledge here, somehow. It is not really nice, but you know, and it will be a quite hard task for you, maybe. But uh, what we want to do is jump all over up here. So jump on this box and go a little bit to left, try to jump up. And we did succeed. Open the door here. Go up. Here is the key. Pick up the key. Go down. Uh, we want to fall down now. Go right and right again. Here is the door. Open the door. We want to go through this here area. Drop down to the right, forward, open the door. Try every door here. It will be locked and it will prepare us for our next section that I need to explain. Uh, let's just uh, turn off the lantern. So, this was really a trap here. Uh, you, wanted, you want to turn off your lantern in order for it to charge it. When you go forward, you will drop down in some kind of basement and our friend is going to chase us. Uh, there will be a very, very easy way to avoid him because uh, 
there will be a little bit of tunnel that you can go under he will go to other side then you go to uh, then you need to go back he will take his time to go back to you and uh, you in the meantime need to solve three puzzles open the lever and proceed to next level it will be quite hard so i do i do really recommend to watch me doing it uh, to see what we need to do and also to see the right uh, answer to the puzzle so it should take around two to three minutes maybe more let's just start as you can see he is here crouch and he is start going to start going here wait for him now here are the mechanisms okay twice do it twice here is the correct answer as you can see here is the correct answer one go back this is the first one second one is the same twice go down wait for him to go back wait a bit and again do it twice here one two go back now for the third time we need to pull the lever and remember lever is really slow so do be careful as you can see the answer is right but before we go through lower him again and continue going here run 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 and open this one wait for it to open and again run if we are lucky there is one more hold it and 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 we are at the end there is nothing more that we can do because as you can see when you put here you just can die so turn back and wait for your friend to come to knock you down of this bridge to go to the next section Thank you for the trophy. Almost half of the game. Skip this ones with circle button. For me, this was the <laughs> toughest area because I didn't like that area. It was really bit a bit dark and strange. But in this area, it is much more complicated. So I don't really console you. Go up here, here is the man that is chasing us. Here is the box that we need, but we cannot yet unlock it. We need to find the key. So we are going to first solve one miscellaneous trophy and one collectible trophy before proceeding the level. So you want to go up here and jump on these planks here. Go up. Jump across. Continue going here to the left and in this area this box is unbreakable i think okay i'm really not it is random uh, there should be one unbreakable box in this area that will serve to us as our Phew. okay something is not really nice happening here <laughs> okay let's just first go get the key get the key okay let's get the first collectible there should there should be a box here um, which could uh, which could really use be, be used to get to collectible okay let's track down all the way to the start of our game to get our next trophy as you can see when you turn back you know where we are now okay so go back let me just go check around maybe it is really random okay nothing I really do not hope that we should need to restart the level. 
<laughs> okay, uh, if this happens to you, I will not cut it out. I am for sure not going to cut it out. Exit to main menu. As you can see, this uh, this is not supposed to happen. Uh, continue the game, of course. You will be in the first area. This is not supposed. Okay, not very nice. We again need to solve the puzzle. Okay, we will do that. I will just cut this scene because we did see it to explain the next area. So I did cut it because this was not supposed to happen. It was some kind of glitch. So we are going to backtrack it. As you can see, what you need to do is uh, the same as me if this happens to you. Let's just be careful. We need to put box here. Let's go all the way back here. Let's try to carefully pick up the box and carefully carry it to the next area. Because this is really easily missable. The collectible and all and everything due to boxes being so really not nice. Okay. Um, let's be more clever than this game. So let's pick up the key. Okay. We are going to pick up the key. We will be much more clever than the game. Okay. Here are the boxes. Let's go for the first box. Let's go for the first box. So jump across. To the starting area. We are going to the starting area. Unlock it. He is now gone. Pick up the box. As you can see, this is really unbreakable box. And there should be one up there also. But not this time. Something is really messing with me. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so we jump across here and put the box here. As you can see, nothing happens to her. Let's try if we can jump with this one box, but it, I think it should not be doable. Okay, it is not doable. So we want to pick one box to put it up there. Let's try with that one. Okay, let's try to put it on the next box here and it broke. Okay, two more to go. This one, is it doable? Okay, I guess it is, if it doesn't break when I jump on it. As you can see here, up, okay, it was just a glitch. It was obviously a glitch. Circle button, and we get our next collectible. Let's just track back. If you didn't do it before, I cut it down due to glitch or something. Uh, when we go back here. Go all the way to the boat to earn the miscellaneous trophy. If you didn't do that before. If you did, okay, go back. And we are done with this section. We got our miscellaneous trophy, our collectible. And we need to go all the way to the starting area. Okay jump across and now yes we were clever than the game uh, go up then go down here when the man starts to chase you which is not yet and now and then he will appear here and go back all the way up up remove the planks enter the door go right 
down, crouch and to the right. And we are in the next area, which is really nice looking and this is going to be a tricky one. Okay, first jump all over here. Here, if you fall into water, don't worry, nothing happens really, you don't die, you can fall into water. We need to go up, hold this lever. Crouch. We cannot open the door, we need a key and the key is going to be here. Run across, but remove the boxes. Be sure to move the boxes because we will need to run later through that section. Remove them. Nice. Here is the key. Okay. Pick up the key. Go all the way back. Open the door. Try to open this door. We cannot open it. Okay. And uh, we need to go back on the bridge again. And we are going to be traced. And you need to jump off the bridge there, as you can see. Okay. 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 When he starts to trace you, jump there. You will hurt yourself a bit, but nothing really too much. So do everything again. Okay, go up, hold the lever to open it and the door should now be open for us, which is continue going forward in this section, go up, go down here to the left. Okay, open the door, right, left, right, here, fall down, open the door, and where this man here, drop down, crouch, and continue going forward. We are now up, crouch and exit. Very good. We are at the balcony. Go through here where you see a cat. It is very good, very good sign. You want to go out, drop down. Now go up. And now look down, you are now able to pass. So drop down. This is a tricky part. Um, try to follow me. Okay. Go through this biggest hole. I, I, I don't know what to say. Not here, but here. You can go here first, here. Stick to the left side. As you can see, here is our friend. Go left. Go right, there is some kind of uh, mechanism here. Go right and stick to the left side. Okay, as you can see here. I'm sorry, stick to the left side, I said, and I didn't stick, no? Very clever for me. <laughs> okay, uh, forward, forward, and when we, sh when we st see a staircase, we are good. So you want to go up. Uh, 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 up should be up here. Test a moment. Okay, here is something. Up and up again. Up again. To the right. Crouch. 
fall down, crouch again, and we are done with the section. Uh, it was really tough one, maybe if you didn't see, but I hope I could help you with this one. So uh, in this section, go down, go down, and we are done with the third sea of wine. We did get the trophy. So here, a couple of things that we need to do. We want to drop down. Let's pick up our next collectible first. Okay, we, you can just uh, hold the circle to make uh, this fall down and hold circle again to make this fall down. Okay, so jump across here, crouch and go all the way to the end of this path. There is going to be a collectible, one out of two in this area. As you can see, it is in front of us. Pick it up. 68%. Go all the way back. And we are going to do a few things. To get the trickiest collectible in the game. Because it is also really missable. Uh, a lot. Uh, and also, uh, it is missable because of two things. You cannot see it. It is not really on your <laughs> normal path. And the boxes are really breakable. Which, as you can see, uh, which you could see before we needed to start over to be able to get the collectible. So, try to listen to me carefully when we do it. Okay. Once we are back in this area, Go all the way back. Now, push the circle button here in order for cart to go out. Uh, up, sorry, up. Pick up this barrel, but walk it down slowly. Walk it down slowly. Okay. Do not let it uh, to be destroyed. I will put it down here. Okay, now this card here, when it reaches its destination, okay, we should have done something first, but okay, uh, put this up, interact with this lever to make this go up here, okay. Now walk it all the way to the back, interact with this lever here. We will need to jump on the cart. We will need to jump on the cart to reach the collectible. The collectible is up there. Up there. So once the cart reaches here, Grab the barrel carefully. I will try to jump on this here and jump on the cart somehow. And I am up as you can see. Now you want to jump across. You want to jump across. And we are. Now carefully, carefully drop down the barrel. Okay. Now drop it down, jump on the barrel, carefully, <laughs> sorry, okay, we were almost there, and now jump a bit to the right and to the left to go on the next ledge, and we were unsuccessful, but it is really okay once the barrel is up there, okay, 
once the barrel is up there it is really not something that we should be worried about try to jump somehow up here I will try to use this lever okay so as you can see why this is tricky we will need to do a few tries because I am also bad at it and I won't cut it just to see that uh, I'm struggling it is okay that you struggle I could just cut and have a perfect scene but there is no need for that let's try to move it a little bit to here okay I am now risking my life <laughs> but okay we moved it a bit to here and now we should be able to jump here nice jump on this one here and jump across and we did it we did the, the hardest collectible in the game find a photo of the cat uh, carefully drop down do not, do not get yourself killed you can drop down here and now again interact with the lever to push the cart and uh, drop down here you can just go forward as you can see nothing happens if you fall into water it's just okay crouch and go all the way until the end of the section A lot of things that we need to do here hold the lever to open the passage enter now in this section man is going to shoot uh, into you you can easily oh okay as, as, as you can see he already shoots he is really a good shooter uh, two things you can hide behind the barrels and everything else and also uh, you can heal yourself as you can see if you just crouch if he doesn't shoot you when the red moves from your screen you are good to go i think two or three shots and you are done so be careful run to the first section when he shoots run to the section second section now wait a bit okay run here run here run here and go to the left okay to the left and here let me just see a moment and we need to go up here okay and across the bridge across the bridge to the other side now be careful if you fall down here I don't know what happens uh, if we fall down uh, if he just starts to shoot because I never did fall before maybe this is the time but go right uh, right forward and now right okay forward left drop down okay drop into the hole crouch and go forward you will drop down hurt yourself a little bit in the butt nothing happens be aware of the fire it can kill you just go forward up up interact with the lever remove the planks okay go through here and to the right 
there should be our lever okay drop down drop down put the lever here let me just show you something hold okay final section of the game as you can see here and we need to go across there across there go up here when you push the cart cart will come this way you need to jump on the cart and then jump all over there okay so press the lever cart will start going and outrun the cart okay and jump on the cart to go to the next area it can be a bit tricky bit because the jump is a bit glitchy but again don't worry if this happens because you can always restart the lever okay and we are on we are traveling okay jump across and continue running and we are done with this section okay very nice we are also very very dead <laughs> i think that we are now in the final part of the game and the final part is the hardest part is the hardest part uh, we did get the trophy 74 percent why is it the hardest part because we need to do a lot of things simultaneous he, we will be chased we will be shot at while solving puzzles and it can be tough love <laughs> okay but uh, we can manage it if you just follow me if you just uh, listen to me we will be okay so first open the drawer pick up the key open the door okay go to the left and then go to the right into the new area go up okay continue going forward and forward again to the left to the right left right okay sorry uh, left then right and now here as you can see there is a collectible come to this place press touchpad and we are true the door should be unlocked pick up the collectible time spent with cats is never wasted go back to the first area As you can see here is the main passage now interact with the left lever now interact with the right lever continue going forward hold up the plank to open the doors And in this area, we are going to pick up our last collectible in the game. Okay, so drop the ba ba barrel here, jump on the barrel, jump on this cupboard here, jump up, jump up, pick up the collectible, and cats rule the world 80% of the game. Here is the man that is shooting at us, but nothing will happen, just continue going forward. As you can see, we cannot finish the game yet. Drop down here, uh, crouch and continue going forward. Okay. 
Okay, so few things first. Uh, go to the right. Go to the right. If I am not mistaken, go through this section here. Okay, okay, okay. Forward and now wait, wait, don't go. He will start shooting at you. We need to go all the way up there to hide and to push the lever. <clears throat> Just be careful. He is shooting. Run. Hide. Push the lever. Wait and go to the right door. Run. Okay. One shot, it is okay. <clears throat> we did drop down. Okay. Go to the right. Go up to the right and again you will be shot. Shot at, sorry. Run, hide, interact with the lever. After this one, we are not going to the right, we are going to the left. So start running. Okay. And walk slowly just to regenerate. You want to drop down into this section here. So, our main friend will come, be careful. And there is a labyrinth that we need to solve. And this is going to become tough. Uh, so I recommend to watch this section before doing it on your own, okay? Hold the lever and immediately go back. Wait for your friend, start running, okay, open the door, drop down, he is going to appear here, okay, okay, forward, forward, until you go to the right side, now go right, go left, right, forward, left, interact with the lever, okay, nice, drop down, Let's lure him to here, okay, and now outrun him, outrun him, and in this next section we are going to be shot at, we are going to be shot at, so be careful, he is chasing us and we are being shot, okay, and we did it, we just run across, go forward, here, drop down, Drop down and he will appear again. He will appear again. We need to first find the key, which is here. Okay, so try to open the drawer. Open the drawer. Open the drawer. Oop. This is really a tricky section, as you can see, and it will last for a bit. So just be prepared. Let's try to lure him. Now run him and pick up the key. Pick up the key. Okay, where are you? You are here. Okay, already. Nice. Good for you. Go down. Go down. Pick up the flashlight. Now wait for him from this side to come to us. Okay. Now run him. Up. Up. Enter the flashlight. Okay. So outrun him, go all the way up and to the right behind this section here and enter this symbol here. This, okay. Wait for him and just go backwards, backwards and fall down. Now we have a little bit of time, okay. So we need to input this symbol here. He will come from this side, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So far, very good. Let's go down to the basement. Okay. Go down to the basement, to the right, and input again the same symbol here. And go here to lure him to us. Okay. 
nice so we now need to find the lever now we need to find the lever and it is doable if you go here open the door pick up the lever and wait for him to go to us drop down and continue going forward when he appears throw the lever and uh, lure him back okay to this side here wait him on the side and start running pick up the lever and go as far as you can you can even put the lever i think we will be able to just put it but not engage it so again lure him to the basement to have some time and we want to interact with the lever again lure him to the basement to have enough time I will, I will just talk you through this is the final section we already did one two and three puzzles and we when that door opens have only two left and we will be able to open the final area okay so input the code here is this one uh, the and here is the this one okay wait for him go to the main door we should now be able to interact with the lever and it opens now wait for him to go here here okay go up to lure him to have some time and we should be done with the section as you can see here are the signs so for omega this sign for this for delta this sign so you can find the signs above and to know which ones are really good for you that you need to do if somehow this is not as you can see he is now again appearing go here this is the same familiar area as before he will come to you open the lever hold to open the lever and again crouch to go back to lure him back and you want to outrun him run 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 Le uh, sorry right and then left and you are now in the familiar area and we get the trophy the seller challenge is completed okay continue going forward and now look to the left we are going to finish the game just run Now pick up the bottle and you will finish this section. The cellar completed. Rotate the bottle. Press circle. And we are done. We only have at least, I think, I think two minutes left for finishing this game. No more puzzles, nothing anymore so once we are here i just would like to thank you if you did follow all the way through this guide i really think i could help you with this guide if i did please leave a like it means a lot uh, or a positive comment uh, to cheer me up <laughs> uh, those things really uh, add up when you try to make a certain uh, guide or quality guide for us trophy hunters and i hope i uh, i hope you are happy with the content i put up 
So continue following. I will try to do as much as I can to help you always. In this section, just go forward. Some of you did see this section from my uh, Platinum screenshot on uh, Twitter. Do not enter any door. You need to climb onto the mountain. To the right, there should be an angel. Sorry, to this right or some kind of statue, very beautiful scene, of course. There should be a grave, Put, uh, interrupt with the circle on that grave to end the game. Epilogue completed, completionist. Thank you guys for watching and see you in my next guide. Goodbye for now.